my dear Pisces, this is your reading as to what's gonna happen when it comes to your money matters for the entire week, you guys. Okay, so this is what's gonna happen for your money matters for the entire week okay so i can sense it seems like you are stalking <laughs> so pisces maybe you're stalking someone or you're checking out on another person or your family member or anyone in the family or within your connection you want to check out on how are they doing when it comes to their finances maybe um you can maybe you're making it as your motivation like for example if you're seeing people like you're the one closest to you like for example like a close friend and you're checking out that person is doing good it seems like Pisces you really want it's like there is this competitiveness like that kind of personality within you that had arises because you, it seems like you're doing it like a fuel motivation fuel for you to, to do more to work hard to push the limits because um for you maybe you are in a state of um in a state of com comfort right now like things are going well but um for you you do not want to be in a comfortable state because what if things were go things are going to go the other way around so this is your way of pushing yourself even further um, without, you know, without having to, like, it's like you're, you're making it as your fuel to do your best. Yeah. So that's why you're stalking. <laughs> or you're stalking um, other people, or your loved ones within your family because you want to check out whether they're, um, they're okay, they're well, or do you need to spend more on their health? Or you, do, you need to spend more on whatever expenses that you need is very vital for that person that is so close to you. Maybe you're keeping an eye with regard to that person or to your family member because you're thinking that what if, you know, this person will get sick? What if there's something is going to happen with this person? At least I am more aware and I will not be shocked later on. Like for you, prevention is better than cure. So you might, you might as well um like check on it on its early stages because if it's on the worst part for sure you know it will be costly on your end especially when it comes to medical bills so uh, yeah i think this is the reason why you're being a stalker right now because it all boils down to finances how much are you go are you going to spend okay so let me see more let's do a clarification on that one Mm hmm okay it's because <laughs> biases when it comes to family matters when it comes to people who are close to you that that are in dire need of your help like financially like you are a giver you have no choice but to give right away to help right away like without blinking an eye you are that type of person that's your personality like when someone is in dire need you would are you are more than willing to give it or to give or help or even go extra mile to help that person and this is very um yeah evident here because it happened already Pisces I can sense it already happened and you do not want to have a repeat of that one okay so that's why you're you're a stalker <laughs> that's why you became a stalker Pisces because it already happened and you do not want to have a repeat on that one second when it comes to your finances this week good job because it seems like everything is not is light-hearted you're not carrying the burden of the world um when it comes to your finances i do not sense you struggling okay and this week is that you were able to breathe like you were able to have that sense of relief knowing that your your money is gonna be good this week okay so let's clarify on that one the reason why you're you're doing well this week is because you, you tend to be emotionally distant okay you tend to be emotionally distant from everything from every chaos 
and maybe uh, some of you Pisces out there you are using your logic right now you do not want to be governed by your emotions because it seems like you already know that emotions can sometimes cloud uh, your decision making like like it seems like because something bad will happen and then a bad is like for example something bad is happening automatically you're going to react and to the point that you're emotionally attached towards it your decision making is being like clouded you're not able to weigh the pros and the cons who would who would be like especially when it's a matter of life and death so i do understand where you're coming from and good thing that you're doing well this week you're being emotionally distant i'm not saying it's a it's like you're gonna be this forever but it is really a good improvement um at your end pisces because you already know what is happening right what had happened and you do not want to have another history repeating itself when it comes to your financial uh, situation another thing this week also i can sense you are taking care of yourself you are prioritizing yourself it's more of self-gratification maybe you're kind of selfish maybe you want to enjoy the fruits of your labor um yeah maybe the very reason maybe the reason behind this is that you already did your share before no wonder you're keeping an eye because you want us you want to splurge this week for yourself i cannot blame you pisces because it was a tough it was a tough journey for you maybe for the past few weeks with what with what is uh, with what had happened and since you are having a breathing space um this week what better way to enjoy life than pamper yourself so i can send some of you might be into pampering yourself buying your favorite food buying your favorite stuff spa massage or whatever pleases you okay so let me clarify on that one pisces mm -hmm. you already had planned it out so i can just like you're telling yourself like if i will pass through this financial difficulty and when i did and when i am going to be i'm gonna make sure i'm gonna pamper myself and you are fulfilling that plan already pisces yep you're already fulfilling that plan of pampering yourself because it was a tough journey and finally you're out from it okay let me see what does the universe has to say when it comes to your finances when it comes to your money this week pisces okay it says here pisces it's a warning 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 for you it says here do not keep things a secret okay <laughs> you need to make sure that everything is being laid down because you do not want surprises okay so for example if if you see someone is sick dig down deeper like do some moves of asking like asking being curious about it okay you do not want uh, a little detail left behind you need to you you, you want to make sure you, you're going to know more about it okay the more you know the more you can really assess whether it needs to be um helped uh, there needs to be like going to the doctor and have a checkup or do you need to pay right away because there will be penalties that kind of that kind of thing and the universe is also telling you pisces if you if you're going to be ha having that drama if you're going to be a drama king or drama queen it will lead to a very awful situation because you cannot stop thinking you cannot stop thinking and i can send some of you pisces out there you, your enemy here is your mind and also your emotions because the moment your logic will shut down your mind is is like going going paranoia it it and I, I mean and you're also having emotional roller coaster ride the moment your logic shut down it would lead to you going to the point of overthinking things okay you're guilty as charge of being an overthinker being someone who always worry like worry what if this will happen what if the worst thing will happen you always worry about the worst thing that is gonna happen and if you're going to look back when it comes to your finances it seems like the more you worry the more you're not able to find solution towards your problem financial problems so 
universe is telling you this week that if you want to have a good um, financial situation you might as well have the details do not go into drama so that you will stop thinking or being paranoid or worry about certain things okay because how can you think the solution to your financial problem if you, you have already thought a lot of scenarios negative scenarios bad scenarios that are going to happen because of the financial difficulty okay so what you need to do is to balance out your emotions in order for your mind to be calm to be subtle because at the end of the day you want to make a very sound decision okay in order to have the outcome that you really want it for because you do not want to have chaos or commotion because it would lead to more financial woes or difficulties like it's like a do domino effect if you know what i mean okay so this is your reading you guys when it comes to your finances for the entire week and thank you so much sending you energies of love 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 and abundance 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 spices <music>